Hello Dreamethians, I am in my kitchen because I wanted to show you guys how to make something in the process of me learning how to make it. Today I am going to make yakisoba and this is from the Asian market that Jacob and I have been going to lately. And this is not the cheap yakisoba that I actually have in my pantry. Let's forget this moment happening where the white mom is like, yakisoba, and then they're like the little white people that are like, yakisoba, but there are no Asian people in it because they know like that shit is not really yakisoba. This is the real stuff, or at least this is a version of it. I'm not sure which one is the best brand to get, but this is one that had English on it and I could at least understand a bit of it and it didn't look like that. <laughs> Um, normally when I cook things, I already know what I'm cooking. I already know that stuff! But today, I don't know how to make this, and I'm hoping that it turns out okay. I've been looking at the directions and, like, familiarizing myself with it, and it doesn't seem hard. So, I'm using, or getting, a single measuring cup, and then I think I need oil is what it said. But I, I know I have some. I know I bought, like, a big, gigantic container of it. And I don't know where I put it. It was like a really gigantic bottle. Oh, there it is. All the way in the back. I knew I had it. I knew it was here. Good. So extra virgin olive oil. That was my pan. And it said to have vegetables too, if you desire. And I have these leftover stir fry vegetables that I've had that I'm going to use. And I just need to show you how little food I have. Everything up here is mine, and all this is my roommate's, except like a couple things on the bottom. And this is the remainder of my food. <laughs> I'm poor. Really freaking poor. Okay, so I'm gonna make this. I mean, I need to set you up somewhere so that you can see everything. Japanese style pan fried noodle. And it says on the side, yakisoba risu. Hmm. Risu. I don't know. Okay, so you're supposed to boil a cup of water in a skillet. Okay, I have, I have my cup of water, and I'm putting in my skillet. So I have to put in this, and then I have to take my vegetables. Okay, just to stir fry it for a minute. But the, it's, the water hasn't even dissolved away yet. So I'll cook, put the temperature on high, maybe? It's starting to get soft. Huh? Oh, and the water's dissolving. It's like evaporating as I'm cooking. I'm probably not supposed to use this, and someone out there is probably screaming that I'm using a spatula. Remove from heat, drizzle one teaspoon of cooking oil and sauce packet. Toss to combine. Okay, so I'm gonna remove it, take it off the heat. Ooh, this looks so good. I'll put it all in there. Okay, I'm gonna try it without any soy sauce or any flavorings or anything at first and then see if it needs it. Okay. Alright. I'm ready. Sun, me, in, digamas. Ooh, it's steaming. Mmm. Ooh, it's so good. I had yakisoba before once, and it was like a traditionally made, and it was more brown than this. So I don't know if I just got a different packet than like what my friend made for me, or if maybe I didn't cook it long enough. But it's so good, and it's the way that yakisoba is to me is really, really very sweet. And this to me is it's not as sweet as I've had it before, but I like it. I'm gonna keep eating this. But thank you so much for watching. Me and all my blunders. I, if you make yakisoba, please let me know. And hopefully it turns out good. Just as good as this one did, if not better. So I'll see you guys all tomorrow. Peace out. Take them out. Oh. If any of you do have a good recipe for sukiyaki, please send me the recipe. I got it by a YouTube message or a Tumblr message or send it on my Facebook or something. Because I really, 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 really want to make sukiyaki sometime. But I just want like a really good recipe. I'm not a huge fish person. So if you know any recipes with fish, I probably won't make it. If you, make, if you have one like with a really good tasting beef or like a chicken, then I can definitely do that.